It was Super Green Eagles all the way here at the Carrara Sports Arena as Nigeria dominated the Gold Coast 2018 pair of powerlifting with all four gold medals and a new world record in the women's lightweight competition. The record was set by the exuberant Esther Aoyima who pressed 131 kilograms on her final lift to set her third world record in the sport for under 50 kilogram athletes. My name is Esther, I'm going to win, she said, I'm going to fight. Aoyima had pressed 125 kilograms in the first round and then called for 131 kilograms. She described her first failed attempt as a silly mistake and revealed she had offered advice to the officials who balance the weights. In powerlifting when they give you the weights, you have to balance, she said, there are different people in different different ways of giving you the weights, so when I came back for the third I said, please gentlemen do it like this, hold it very tight for me, even if you have all the strength, you must have good technique, if you don't have good technique you will end up with zero, Roland Ezorouik won the men's lightweight division, copyright Getty Images, we have to be careful with our attempts and our technical work, oh you must compatriot Lucy Educa posted 133 kilograms but won silver due to her heavier body weight, England Zoe Newson lifted more than double her own body weight for bronze, 91 kilograms. There was a tremendous contest in the men's lightweight class where the top two positions from the Glasgow 2014 Commonwealth Games were reversed. Roland Azorwick lifted 188 kilograms and followed up with 194 kilograms to take gold. The complex formula used to calculate results based on body weight gave him a score of 224.3. It was very tough, he said, I do have a master's degree but it is a game we know, we know how to make the calculations. Paul Kahinde was champion four years ago but came into the competition weighing 62 kilograms, giving his lighter rivals a significant advantage. It is very very hard for me to beat people with lower body weights, he said. After lifting 221 kilograms which was not enough on the point system, I was able to adjust my body weight but you lose strength, I could not go home empty-handed, I have a silver so they should be happy with me, bronze medalist Ali Jawad of England only returned to competition seven weeks ago after a relapse of Crohn's disease and lifted 161 kilograms, just to make it on the field was a miracle and to perform like that is a bonus, he said, I had to think about the dark times, that is what got me through it, I was never supposed to make it and that is what drove me on, and Idi Owusu was a comfortable winner of the women's heavyweight category for lifters over 62 kilograms. Abdulaziz Ibrahim won the men's heavyweight gold medal copyright Getty Imagesh lifted a best of 120 kilograms. Louise Sugden of England edged out the Kenyan Joyce and Jay Guna for silver by 0.2 points, lifting a best of 103 kilograms. No bronze medal was rewarded as only four lifters took part. Abdulaziz Ibrahim won the men's heavyweight class in front of, of Malaysia's Yi Kijong, although both had best lifts of 220 kilograms. The real drama was in third where India's Sachin Chaudhry snatched bronze from Scotland's Michael Ewell. Chaudhry had two no lifts despite a protest lodged by the Indian team. His last attempt was successful at 201 kg, as Ewell's best was 174 kg. It is a lifetime opportunity, it is a lifetime medal for me, it is a life-changing medal for me, said Chaudhry. It is a high-level event so much high regard if you win a medal in the Commonwealth Games.